Hi, we were just looking around for some invertebrates. Can you say invertebrate? Good job. Invertebrates are our other animal friends. And invertebrates are animals that have no backbone. Wait, what? There's one on me? Where? Where? <laughs> oh, thank you. Yeah, I'm a scientist, but there's something about spiders that just gave me a little creeped out. That's okay. We're just gonna pull it together and study them anyway. So, invertebrates, okay. Invertebrates, no backbone. Vertebrates have a backbone. Invertebrates, no backbone. Got it? Okay, good. So don't forget your invertebrate sorting chart and your little invertebrate friends, okay? So while we go through these, I want you to find them and sort them out. All right, here we go. Are you ready? Okay. Invertebrates have classes too. What do you know? Do you remember our vertebrate classes? I hope so. Okay, good job. So invertebrates have classes too. Invertebrates are made up of insects, arachnids. Can you say arachnid? Good job. Mollusks, can you say mollusks? Good job. Echinoderms, can you say echinoderms? Good job. Crustaceans, can you say crustaceans? Good job. But we're just gonna focus on two, insects and arachnids. And today we will just talk about insects. So are you ready? Let's do it, I'm so excited. Insects have three body parts. That's right, three. A head, a thorax, can you say thorax? Good job. And an abdomen. Can you say abdomen? Very good. Now let's talk legs. How many legs do you think insects have? How many do you have? Well, I have two. What do you have? Three, four? No, I think you have two. Insects have six. Six legs. I need you to remember that. How many do they have? Six. Very good. And they don't have a backbone. Nope, they don't. But they have something called an exoskeleton. Can you say exoskeleton? Very good. And almost all insects have wings. That's right, wings. Very good. Okay, let's look at some. Ladybugs, insects. Ants, insects. Grasshoppers, insects. And we've sent you some. In these four cubes, there are insects. Do you know which ones are insects? Let's try to sort them out. Get your magnifier, look up close, find those three body parts, and how many legs? That's right, six. Great job! So go find them, and then do your invertebrate sorting. All right, we will see you next time. See you later.